taking on the role of temporary host, Colin exclaimed it was an absolute honor to present Countdown after Anne leaves the show in July. He is no stranger to presenting the Channel 4 show as he has previously stepped in for Nick Hewer when he took time off from the role. Colin, 45, confirmed the news on Twitter, telling his 202,800 followers, I'm like the assistant manager, given the job until end of season. Earn respect of dressing room, at Susie underscore Dent at Rachel Riley, get some points on the board, try to win a trophy. 75 games to get it right. Absolute honor. Faves show ever. July 14th to start of November hashtag countdown. It wasn't long before Colin was inundated with support from Countdown fans with many praising his appointment. Absolutely brilliant news, they have to give you the gig this time, David Ely tweeted. Gabby Logan posted, so thrilled for you Colin, as Dave Gorman tweeted, excellent news. Congrats. Ed Harris shared, well done Colin. The right man for the job. I love Susie and Rachel, don't play them out of position, congratulations Colin, I'm looking forward to the shows with you, Angry wrote. Colin will host the popular show from July to November as bosses try to find a permanent replacement for Anne. The presenter confirmed she'd be leaving after a year at the helm and denied rumors of a feud with Rachel Riley. And revealed, I've had a blast hosting this wonderful show. And I stayed longer than I signed up for. Now it is time for an older woman to take the reins. She continued, I hope to I've encouraged TV bosses to realize that not all women at the wrong end of their 70s are in care homes playing bingo and watching conjuring tricks. In fact the genius of Countdown is that it's a brilliant way to keep the brain exercised. I run 5k most days of the week. And I can now do an anagram at twice the speed I could this time last year. Instead she wants to focus on her family and home in New York and her garden. Speaking on whether she'd been feuding with Rachel, and detailed, I'm not saying I would go on holiday with Rachel Riley, but she is brilliant. Absolutely honestly, I do admire her, she is really, really good at what she does, as is, co-star, Susie Dent. She did however confirm reports she had asked for Rachel's microphone to be turned down. She is noisy, yes she and Susie both are, they are a formidable pair those two, Anne explained.